Hi Leos, welcome to my channel. We're doing your reading. This is your Tarot After Dark. Sorry, the, I forgot. This is Tarot After Dark. <laughs> the energy is dark. <laughs> I need to switch. You know? <laughs> I thought this is the happy read. This is the mystic read. So if you're uh, willing to stay, I'm going to be using this Tarot deck and this Tarot deck. So um, let's see what you guys have for me. Okay, so be warned. This is not a... Happy, 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 happy reading. Okay. Let's see. Knight of Coins is your first card. A card of stillness. Now, silent water runs deep. That's how I would probably describe this card. It is known as a Taurus card. Mm -hmm. So in your situation, there's a lot of uncertainty, but you don't know. Because it's not moving anywhere. You may want it to go fast as a fire sign, but if it's an, it's an earth energy, then it stands still. How long? It will move probably just the right amount. Mm -hmm. So relationship for you is always an issue because you want it to go fast and let's go, let's do this. And the person that you always meet or the situation is always just as a standstill. Not going anywhere. Now, this card also keeps a lot of secret. Mm -hmm. If it's a Taurus in a seventh house is Scorpio, then it only means your relationship is not seen in the public. It's kept hidden. And if it's a Scorpio energy, as it's seventh house, there's also some mystery in it, some mystic energy. Mm -hmm. which makes you want to know why you guys are never really official, never really putting anything, probably picture or talking about you to their friends. There's always a wall. There's always a wall. It's imaginary. You don't see it, but you feel it. You know it. Like every time, you know, you're going to talk to this person, privacy is going to be an issue to them. Like they need to keep things to themselves. Knight of Wands, the fly by night. Duality is Knight of Wands. I look at the cards like astrology. If it's a Sag, then the seventh house is Gemini. Then there's duality and disconnection. So which means that this person is hot and cold. Hot and cold with you. Mm -hmm. The way that they treat you is basically unpredictable. Sometimes they really, really desire you. And sometimes you don't even know if they want you. Mm -hmm. This is in the coming days. If you're just dating someone, you also... You feel it more and more. It becomes more evident. Why is this person, if, it, if they're anything that they're consistent at, is that they're consistently hot and cold with you? King of Pentacles. And there's a promise here. Oh, at some point, we can be together. King of Pentacles, which you make, it makes you cling into this person. I mean, of course, they're good looking. This is that part. Fun to be with, adventurous. Loves to eat good and fine dining food. You know, very bougie taste over here. Aesthetically pleasing is here. Mm -hmm. Can also be um, very, very, uh, can be very tall also. Has a good job. Mm -hmm. Is this one? So complete package, but a complete moron. Oops, sorry. I don't know if I can say that. Mm -hmm. No, it was intentional. <laughs> So let's see what's the other tarot here. Let's 
see. The page of ones. Yeah, that's an issue right there. Mm -hmm. It's an issue because this is about when they want to bang, they call you. So it's a wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. If you get a thank you. Page of ones. Mm. Now the page of ones is a very enthusiastic individual that you're dating with. And they're always enthusiastic. I see here that they might even ask you in the coming days for some sort of vacation. Hey, you want to go away? Go away. <laughs> not go away. You want to get away, not go away. I think that's what you're going to tell this person. You want to go away. So this is the invitation. This is a trip, is a sag. Okay. They will even provide for it. Oh, and just be careful. They will cancel. This always put a stop. Mm -hmm. This card. So in the coming days, you will see this. You will come back to this reading. You're going to get that message. Enthusiastic. I want to see you. Maybe you go out on a Saturday or maybe even, you know, a weekend. Let's go out there. You know, this is that one. We go on a hike. Let's go on a, you know, a camping, you know, like this one. I know this nice place. Let's go away. You're going to get that invitation. And you're also going to get the cancellation. So be warned. Readings are helpful if they can warn you. If it already has happened, it's useless. And it's just not timeless. If you didn't get an invitation, don't cling to this reading. Page of Wands with the Page of Swords. Yeah, really, really um, excited to see you, this person. Hmm. The Page of Swords over here looks at you. I don't even see your card here, Leo. But this person is always looking at you. Okay, so this is a stalker energy. Page of Swords because they gather information and data. Page of Wands here is like they really, really like you aesthetically, which means like they got the hots for you. Mm -hmm. I want to do the dirty. Mm. Ace of Swords. The communication. Travel, visa, passport. That's that one. Um, This person is claiming, listen, I'm just telling you the truth. Ace of Swords. Mm. Whatever they're telling you, okay, it's the truth. But their action also is the truth. Because why they always stop. Mm. They, which they will. Which they will tell you also. It's like, oh, I got work. King of Pentacles. But you made a commitment. You know, the commitment is here. But it's a page committing to you. Mm -hmm. It's a page that you're talking. And their commitment really is where? Is at work. King of Coins. So they're not really focused on establishing their relationship. Because if anything, they would always just drop you. Hot and cold. Okay? I will continue this reading. Link down there in the description box below. Bye. <laughs> Welcome to e Love Flagship Store, where we have everything that you need for your metaphysical, magical, spiritual needs. Everything here you can see is our own creations. Different crystals that you can wear, amulets or diffusers, to also to some unique items, which is our pick-me-up crystals. Our focal point is our healing fountain. So this fountain I specially made for people who come here to enjoy abundance and prosperity at the same time enjoying the ambience of the store. I want you to even feel the experience by visiting our store in Studio City. I'll see you then.